Welcome to Skinny TV on YouTube once again. Let's take the latest news coming in from the camp of Ghana, Black Glasses. Then we are also going to talk about one black stars of Ghana's defender, Mohamed Salusu. Today, he was in action. In fact, he was the best player on the pitch for his club side. But unfortunately, his club side lost the game today. We will talk about it here on this channel. How is everything going in Ghana? has set our next match and it is done ghana versus niger let's talk about the details on this channel now before then can you like the video after liking make sure it's smash and subscribe button put on the bell for more updates on this channel so as the title actually give to you ghana will play against niger at what time at what date at which venue let's talk about the details now now today as i have already brought you an update that ghana we were supposed to meet one of the teams in group e and um, Group E fixture, the last one was between Cameroon and um, the team in the name of Niger or the country Niger. And the game shockingly ended one goal to nil for Niger. Niger were fantastic in on the day. In fact, they threw in all the arsenals, tried everything possible to win. Before the game, they were having only one point and Cameroon were having three points. But after the match, they won and got four points to top the group as Cameroon has been eliminated. Samuel Eto'o was there and you can see the disappointment on his face and everything. Therefore, Niger has shockingly booked their place in the quarterfinals to meet the Ghana Black Galaxies. So, the game is going to happen this Saturday. This Saturday at 7 o'clock p.m. As I said already, at Oran. And I'm going, it's going to happen in there. I already brought you an update that the Ghana Black Galaxies will be moving to a new place in order to play this particular fixture so in iran in algeria it is going to be ghana versus niger now after this game the country that will qualify from the um, quarter final stage will meet either algeria or ivory coast the host country or ivory coast so in the semi-final if ghana is able to eliminate niger that means that the ghana black galaxies will meet algeria the host country or Ivory Coast, the, the, the country that also qualify in there will come and face the Ghana Black Galaxy. So that's the update for you on this channel. So Saturday, 28th of January 2023 at Oran, it is going to be Niger versus Ghana. It is set, done, and that is the update for you on this channel. Now today, oh, there was one big game in there. That is the English EFL Cup semi-final. And um, they are going to play it in two, um, the two legs. And today we had Newcastle versus Southampton. Southampton were rather at home, so it is Southampton versus Newcastle. And at the St. Mary's, it was a tough, tough, tough game. But hey, Newcastle won by a goal to nil. Nick Pope was very key for them in post. He actually denied um, Southampton scoring, um, you know, fantastic goals before. Even Newcastle got that fantastic goal to help them. And Black Stars of Ghana's defender. Mohamed Salisu was in action and he got the highest rating for his club side. Um, that is Southampton. And um, he got a rating of 7.6. Even though they did not win, but his performance was super. He played 90 minutes for them and he did not score no assists though. But he made six clearances as a defender. Clearances off the line. He made one. He blocked one shot. He made two interceptions in the game. He also made four tackles for himself. Touches were 51 in the game. Accurate passes, he gave 20. The accuracy was 71.4%. Ground was won, where 4 out of 5 he went in for. Area was he won, um, or he did not win any out of the 1 he went in for. Possession loss were 9. He made 1 foul in the game as well. Getting a rating of 7 points is the highest for his club side. And um, unfortunately, they lost by a goal to no goal. Scored by um, Newcastle's player in the name of Joel Entien Hue. Uh, in fact, Newcastle made two changes. Um, St. Maximum came in. Then Alexander Isak also came in. Isak would dribble beautifully, run, and give um, Joel Entien a very low cross. Yeah, just in the sense he had was and he just needed to tap home. Newcastle, um, Southampton rather later on took a red card. Where Juje Chelaka actually got a red card um, at the last and best of the game. So that is it. So the first leg is done at the um, St. Mary's Park. It is Southampton nil, Newcastle 1. So let's see how things will go. Who now goes to meet Manchester United in the final? As Manchester United will also be playing against Nottingham Forest. I'll be bringing more updates on this channel. Black Stars, Organized Defender. 
what's in action stands did not really go on well for him but personally he actually performed really really well the ghana black allergies will also face niger this saturday 28th of january 2023 at 7 pm don't forget to like the video subscribe put on the bell for more updates here on this channel this is skinny tv and of course we shall meet later